Alright guys, welcome back to another video. So in today, well not today's video, but this week's video I guess, I'm going on holiday, going camping, and obviously I won't have access to my home gym. All I'm bringing is some 5kg dumbbells, so I'm going to show you my workouts with them. And at the end of the week, see if I've lost muscle, you know, lost fat, see whatever happens, because obviously uh, I won't have my protein powder or like uh, as good food, I guess. But I'll still try and eat as healthy as I can do. And I'll probably be quite active, so I think I might even lose some weight. Um, but yeah, I'll just see how it goes, and I'm not going to stress over food and exercising, because it's just nice uh, to not stress about it. But I'll still take you through my workouts and see, like uh, what I said, if I lose, gain, see what happens. So here's me at the start. Uh, another one over here. Another one over here. Another one over here, hopefully. Um, so yeah, I just took them start start of the day, hadn't done anything. And I'll take one next Monday at the same time and see what happens. So yeah, I've just finished an ab workout that I'll put like 40 seconds or 30 seconds of clips up now. And now I'm just going to get some eggs on toast and then finish, finish what? And then have a shower and then go off uh, on holiday, I guess. And then I'll catch up with you tomorrow when I'm doing my first workout with the 5kg dumbbells. All right, so for my first workout, I'm just going to do a push workout with four supersets and then finish with hill sprints, how I'm going to do uh, on every workout. I have my mat down over there, but I can't be too loud because I don't want to wake everyone up. But yeah, should be good. I'll probably show some clips. And yeah, let's get on with the workout. And I'm going to swim afterwards. focus on the what's it called mind to muscle connection so yeah it was a good workout my phone's on five percent so i'll update you when i'm at home well, not at home well in my caravan i guess uh, with what i'm gonna have afterwards and i'll just show you a picture and then i'll be here the same time for more tomorrow for my second workout uh while camping but yeah good workout uh triceps chest shoulders felt good Alright guys, it's day two. I actually slept well tonight, you know, earbuds. 
and I'm doing back and biceps today, which is going to be hard because the back is one of the larger muscles, so it uh, uses more weight. My brother wants me to tell you that he is... Hello. He's very excited to join me, yeah. as you can see. But yeah, I'm just going to do four supersets, basically till failure, and just mind-to-muscle connection, uh, like last time. And yeah, do this workout, and then get some food when I go back. And yeah, that, that, that should be good. Alright, so I finished off the workout with shrugs, which felt good. Uh, I'm not going to do hill sprints today, because I don't have much weight for legs tomorrow, so I'll just do hill sprints, like, free after every exercise or something. So, yeah, good session. Uh, I felt I felt like my traps uh, were good at the end with the uh, super set that I did, and my bicep and back uh, feeling good. So now I'm going to go home, uh, get some food, and I'll show you what I eat today. And then, yeah, I'll be back tomorrow for a leg workout and a run. All right, guys, welcome back to day four, I think it is. As you can see, I'm on a run and not doing a leg workout. I just wasn't really that motivated to do, like, 50 lunges and, like, 50 glute bridges to get somewhere near failure. So I'm doing my mum's couch to 5k with her. Just a easy like 28 minute run for me, I guess. But it's just a bit of a rest day because I couldn't really be motivated to do a uh, leg workout, like I said. So I'll keep you updated when I've finished the run. And now I'm just gonna get on with the run, then go in the pool like usual after the run, even though it's raining. All right, run has been done. Ended up doing about 4K-ish in uh, like 28 minutes, but it was a comfortable pace and <laughs> it was just very hilly. Uh, but I haven't run in ages, so it wasn't like my full pace or anything. Just a bit of a rest day before I come out and do a run. So yeah, just gonna go back and I'll show you my food throughout the day. And yeah, I've been uh, probably in a deficit because I've been doing lots of activities uh and stuff but that's fine and i'll see where i end up at the the end of the week all 
All right, so it's my final day. I'm just gonna do upper body workout. And I'm gonna do three supersets and then one just set of push-ups into close grip push-ups for the, the triceps. So I'll show you this workout and then I'll catch up with you tomorrow, which will be the end of the, the week uh, of the challenge. So yeah, let's get into it. All right guys, so it's now next Tuesday. So I took some uh, before and after photos of the week of 5kg dumbbell training, which I'll put up like here, 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 and here hopefully. But I think the main thing to take away that uh, a week of training really won't change your body at all, uh, unless you go into a massive uh, calorie deficit or a massive surplus. Obviously you'll put on lots of fat or you'll lose lots of muscle either. Either way, but I didn't do that because I just ate sensibly and until I was hungry. So my body's basically the same, uh, which I'm pleased with. And I'm excited to get back into lifting weights again. And I've ordered some new weights. So I'm going to have uh, some more weight to, to squat and deadlift with, which should be good. Um, so yeah, that's where, uh, that's kind of what happened with the week. Uh, thanks for watching the video. Uh, like and subscribe. And yeah, I'll see you. I don't know when I'm going to be uploading uh, when I think of an idea or do something interesting in my training. I'll just kind of upload it to YouTube, I guess. But yeah, like and subscribe and I'll see you soon.